Okay, y'all. So we're gonna see what Spirit wants the collective to receive right now. All right, Holy Spirit. All right. Eight of Pentacles, reverse. Seven of ch uh, the Chariot, reverse. Creeping. Somebody failed. They wasn't able to overcome something. They were trying to, yeah, look. They were trying to keep something alive with this death in the reverse. And they, they failed. So now they're creeping. <laughs> All right, we're jumping right into this. All right, they're, they're creeping right now. What are they creeping? They're watching you or watching your person it says here too late yeah look <laughs> they're creeping because they're wondering if it's too late yeah look we got baby mama drama y'all all right there's a baby mama right now who was trying to keep you stuck is what i'm seeing she did some type of work here with this uh eight of pentacles but in the reverse it's like whatever work she did it didn't work <laughs> okay and she wasn't able to overcome this with this chariot all right uh chariot is also a cancer, a cancer could be significant right now. You could be seeing owls. Uh, owls is definitely, there's a message there with that. Like, there's going to be, like, some type of ending, a, a death or something. And this could be, again, connected to this death, you know? Like, yeah, look, they don't want this ending. They don't want a death to happen in this situation. They want somebody back, all right? They're wondering if it's too late. They're watching you. What's at the bottom here? Oh, my goodness, you cannot make this up. This is somebody with, whoops. Oh, my God. Hold on. All right, they're definitely watching somebody. See, just like there's like a creep. Okay, they're watching. Now, this is somebody with community dingling or community poom poom. Whoever this person is to you, it could be your baby mama, or it could be your baby daddy, or it could be your ex. I want to get back into your energy. Take it how it resonates. All right, but they want you back. All right, but this is not somebody who who you need to go back to. You need to leave this shit alone because this person is doing voodoo. They're trying to see if the, if the voodoo is working. Like I said, they're trying to put some work in here with the eight of pentacles. See how it says here. Work in progress? Yeah, but that work is not in progress. That work ain't working. See what I'm saying? So they went to this practitioner to do this, this voodoo, whatever, this love love spell, so that you could come back, and it's not working. So now they're watching with this creeping. They're watching you. They're watching your divine feminine or your divine masculine. If you already, you know, already connected with this person and they know who they are, they're watching them as well, all right? Trying to see if, there, if there's a reconciliation. Looking for clues, all right? This creeping is also giving me, uh, like, looking through... um. We, we, we have here social media with the cyberbullying, but I'm also getting like, you know, readings, you know, like this person could be doing readings to see what's going on, to see if the voodoo's working and stuff like that. Tell me more, Holy Spirit. Okay, we have here, yeah, <laughs> cut down. You cutting this person out of your life. We have separation, stop the pattern, silent treatment, and cutting out. You could be doing all of this already. You know, you're not talking to this person. You are stopping the pattern. You're cutting them out of your life. There's a separation, all right? And you're going to stand on that. You're going to keep moving forward. You're not going to let this person uh, continue to manipulate you, all right? To continue to cheat on you with that community dingling or community poom poom. And look, we got karmic ties. You are cutting this karmic tie, all right? You cut in this karmic tie. Okay, tell me more. Yeah, you are not investing into this. You realize that it was not a wise investment with this card in the reverse. You're not you're not investing into this any longer. All right, the moon card. Yeah, the moon card in the reverse is saying that there was a lot of things hidden here. There was a lot of things, a lot of illusions here, okay? And now within the reverse is saying that you're seeing past the illusions. You're seeing the truth about this situation. And that's what you're realizing, that this was not a wise investment. Investing your money, your time, your energy into the situation. Ten of cups in the reverse. You could have had a family. Uh, or maybe, you, you know, maybe you thought that this was your child for some of y'all. All right? But you, yeah, look, a shame. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> you see what I'm saying? For some of y'all, you thought this was your child. All right? Now this karmic is feeling guilty, embarrassed. They are in the wrong because they lied. All right? They knew what was going on. Look, look at how this person, yo, you cannot make this up. I knew I was picking up on that energy. Look at this child right here. It's in the reverse. This is somebody with the queen of pentacles in the reverse. She's not nurturing. She is not a good mother. And again, a child in the reverse is saying, this is not your child. All right? For some of y'all, you found this out. Okay? What we have here at the bottom? We have here, look, again, the person who is trying to make sure that you don't end this with them. All right? But you found out that it was a wise investment to move forward. Okay? It wasn't a wise investment to stay stuck here, you, you realize that you wasted time and energy. But remember, everything that you go through is not in vain, all right? You, this is a lesson that you need to experience. Now that you learned the lesson, good. Move move on. That's all you need to do. God is going to handle the rest, okay? 
But this karmic right here, they they it's like they, they're not trying to take no for an answer, but they're gonna be they're gonna be humbled right now because God is about to show them that God exists. I don't know, they must think that God don't exist because they're trying to pay God, play God in your life. So they're gonna get humbled, all right? So we have here a queen of wands. Okay, so we got the queen of wands, a karmisha, someone who's for the streets, somebody who is promiscuous, okay? And then we have a court, a court date, okay? There's a court date happening, and we have here unconditional love, self-love, wholeness, affection, attraction, selflessness, all right? So this person, I don't know, this, they're going to have to love themselves, you know? <laughs> I feel like this with this love card coming out in the back, this person is going to have to love themselves, okay? Because, yeah, look, look at this person here sitting down. This is somebody who loves themselves. You know, you're meditating, you're spending time in nature, you're chilling. If this is in the reverse, it's like, no, you don't love yourself, okay? You don't love yourself. And I, I don't know, for some reason, I, I feel like Spirit is saying with this card, with the, you know, like they, they don't love themselves and they get themselves caught up in shit, you know, with court. Uh, also, maybe somebody's sick. I don't know, I'm picking up on that too, with that promiscuous energy. Tell me more. We have here the grass was not greener on the other side it was fake all right this person is realizing that this is not what they thought that it was okay we have here secret accounts so again this karmic is stalking okay stalking from a secret account stalking you stalking them all right let's see what she got to say i've seen the naughty pictures that you sent him oh well damn <laughs> for some of y'all this karmic is a stripper of the answer all right, she wanted this person to pop the question. She wanted to be married to this person, or she is. And they're going to have a divorce. They could be engaged, all right? And this person realized, like, yo, this is not what I'm trying to do here, all right? And she saw some type of pictures. Maybe you didn't send him nothing naughty. For some of y'all, you did, you know? You sent him you sent him some juicy pictures, you know? But for some of y'all, maybe you didn't send him nothing, nothing like that. She saw that shit, all right? Three of Pentacles, we have here collaboration. She knows this person wants to collaborate with you. She knows that this person wants to get it popping, all right? This person want to link up with you. Tell me more. We have here goodbye. Yeah. She knows that you want to, or, or your person want to collaborate with you, flip it however you need to. You want to say goodbye, or this person want to say goodbye. It says, I wish I never let him talk me into getting in a what? Yeah, an abortion. <laughs> wow. Okay, whatever. Uh, What else? What card fell out? This one. We have played out. Yeah, she's played out. He's like, goodbye, you know. She's played out. I'm not dealing with this no more. I think he's happy that she got this abortion because he didn't want to be trapped with this karmic. Absolutely not. Let's see what else. Yeah, this karmic is a drag ass. Tell me more, Holy Spirit. We have here the Queen of Cups reverse. So again, Karmisha, Okay. This karmic could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag. She could be a, a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. And then with the Pentacles one that came out, Aries, Leo, no, uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, okay? So we have here uh, Seven of Wands. Uh, we have here Defense Mechanism, but this is this is like talking about not having protection, not being, uh, you know, what is, oh, wow, look at that, the devil in the reverse, wow. This person, they could have been attacking this person to, you know, attacking their protection. Yeah, nine of wands. They was doing this very uh, frequently, you know. They was continuously trying to attack somebody uh, so that they don't they don't free themselves, okay? Because they wanted this person to be like that, you know, binded to them. See, they wanted them trapped. So this person with this in the reverse, they're freeing themselves from this karmic. So they was attacking their protection, all right? This queen of cups reverse was continuously attacking somebody's protection but it's like no this person is protected <laughs> all right shit, that shit ain't working yeah knight of swords they were taking action continuously very determined to do this <laughs> very determined y'all yeah five of swords but look in the reverse is saying that they wasn't able to get this done all right, there wasn't, this is like five of swords is winning at all costs. So in the reverse, it's like, bitch, you lost. All right, you couldn't win at all costs. Okay, they tried it. A lot of swords energy. So def definitely an air sign can be significant here. And look, five of pentacles in the reverse. This person is out of here. Okay, they're out in the cold spiritually. Again, they don't have no protection. Uh, financially, they're going through problems. They could be losing their job, losing their stability. If they was clinging on to a divine masculine or divine feminine for some type of stability, it's over for that. They're left out in the cold. Okay, they're being ghosted. They're being blocked. All right, it's over for that. Everything. Tell me more. It's a lot of cards. I'm going to put it back. 
Okay, tell me more, Holy Spirit. We have here, wow. Didn't I say that I was picking up on this energy that somebody was burning? I felt this energy, like somebody was burning, y'all. So this could be something that this, this divine masculine or divine feminine also found out about this karmic that they have some type of sexually transmitted disease and they don't want they don't want nothing to do with this all right they're, they're like over that mm -mm. okay they're like yo i'm not dealing with this all right somebody's going bankrupt okay they're going broke they're in debt could be this this karmic energy and this is their karma <laughs> confirmation all right this is their judgment their karma right now they're gonna be going broke they're gonna be in debt all right, they're gonna have problems with the law. We saw something about a court date, and they're gonna have and they have this STD that's burning them. Good lord. All right, we have here, yeah, because this karmic, everything that they did is because they were being money hungry. Everything, everything, trying to trap this person, trying to send death spells towards you, kill you, kill him. Anyway, like, you know, like everything was about money. Like, it's really creepy how, how weird these people are. All right, and we have here closing the cycle. This karmic, they didn't want them to close the cycle out, they were very desperate to, to not close out this cycle, but that's it, it's over. All right, so let me put some cards from here real quick. I got a bunch of different piles here. Okay, Holy Spirit. What does the collective need to know so we can close this out? Okay, I miss you. So again, I feel like this could be this uh, masculine wanting to come towards the divine feminine or, the, or, you know, flip the roles. I feel like they miss you. I feel like they want to come towards you. All right, we saw that earlier. Five of Cups in the reverse. So this person, they was feeling regret. They was feeling, you know, like they fucked up, all right? With this in the reverse, I feel like they want to fix that, you know? They don't want to feel like that no more. They're missing you. They want to, you know, get back on, on your good side. Tell me more. All right, Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. This person, I feel like they're, they're, they're sorry for whatever they got into with this karmic. That they, they had a family with them or they was living with them or again, they was engaged, whatever. Like, I feel like they're sorry. Again, the grass was not greener on the other side. So they're sad that they chose this other person. All right. With the temperance now, the bottom of the deck, this is what, what the intention is. You know, they want to bring balance into this connection again. All right. And um, this, this is also the card of a Sagittarius. A Sagittarius could be significant. Anything else? Karmisha. Like, come on, girl. We done with you already. Oh, look, she's secretly smashing his friend, okay? This could be the person who gave her the STD. Again, look, this queen of swords. She could be a Gemini Libra Aquarius, or, or this friend is a Gemini Libra Aquarius, okay? Give me one more. Wow. <laughs> Spirit want to keep exposing her. Oh my God, y'all. I just said that she could have caught this STD from his friend, y'all. Look, sexual infection, sexual disease, all right. She caught a case. Double confirmation with this other card right here that they're burning. <laughs> oh my goodness. And look, Carmen confession. This is her confession. I'm secretly smashing his friend. They're having a romantic love affair. That is so crazy. That is disturbing. So that's why he's walking away. Look, they could be messaging each other, linking up on the low low, you know, flirting with each other. And that's what it led to. An STD. Right here. Look at that. Look, look at the results. Girl, you nasty. Bro, you nasty. They both nasty. They deserve each other. All right. <laughs> All right. So that's what I got here. This cycle is closed. All right. It is what it is. Let them deal with each other. Uh, divine masculine and divine feminine is about to get into union. So, hey, peace.